Hi, welcome to Driving TV and I hope you are well. In this video, I like to help you with the turning points at junctions. So it's the turning points at junctions and when you should take the wheel back after you made the turnings. So when you're turning on junctions, going left and going right, when should you do the steering? At which point? And also after you made the turning, when should you take the wheel back? On junctions and when I say junctions I mean um, turning left and right from a major road into a minor road and from minor road into a major road so these are the two things I will help you in this video I hope you enjoyed the video I hope this video helps and uh, if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe so don't miss any of my future videos and uh, let's start the lesson okay so the subject is turning point at junctions and then taking the wheel back after you've made the turning. Now, every corner is different, every junction is different. So you cannot have one reference point for every single junction because every junction will have different corners or different turnings. As you can see here, going left from there to there, it has a sharp corner. This has a long corner. So this is going left from a major road into a minor road and this is going left and right from minor to a major and same here and as you can see every junction has different turning points so for you to know at which point you need to do the turning is at when the curve bends so in this one it bends here and that's a sharp one and on this one it bends here and it's a long one and the steering cannot be the same for both so for this one you will be driving until you see this corner on the left corner of your dashboard in the corner of your car and that's when you start steering and you have to do the steering quite quickly because it's quite sharp but if you were on this one you can't steer here because that'll be too late. You need to steer from here because that's when the curve bends. And then gradually you steer and you go round. Because on this one, you have to do it slowly. And on this one, you have to do it quickly. And on this one, you do it at this point. And on this one, you start at this point because this is when the curve starts to bend. If you don't, you'll end up going like that. When the curve is bending from here you should be going like that for this one you will be starting to steer from here and gradually go round and on this one you will start steering here quickly and you end up going in there same with this one at the end of the road um, here when you're going to the end of the road same if it's a sharp one you go to the end keeping the car straight and at this point here you start steering and for this one, you have to start steering from here because you don't want to end up going there and then do that. You have to go with the curve, the way the curve is going. And then if this is the end, look if it's safe and then you go. So if, you, if this junction had cars on the main road, you don't go straight and stop. You need to go steer with the pavement or with the curve and stop here and then make your turn. When this one, you keep it straight because the curve is straight and here you start steering. So the main point I am trying to highlight here is the point that you start steering will depend on the corner or the curve of the pavement. If it's sharp, you keep it straight and do it at where the sharp point is. And if it bends, you do it when the curve starts to bend. Now let's see when we go right, what is the reference point? So if you were going right, from here to there, um, you looked at the mirrors, you've done the position, and your position is going to be close to the center. And the point is when roughly your car is around in line with the center line, in line. And from your sitting, where you are sitting, you will see your side mirror is in line with that. That's where you're going to see when the when the front of your car is in line, you, you will see the right side of your mirror is in line with the center. 
that's what you're going to see from sitting um your sitting position you will see the right side mirror is in line and that's when you start steering and when you go to the end and to go right if it is sharp keep it straight and don't steer until you reach the halfway and then you steer don't steer here you need to go to your side and then steer so keep it straight until halfway then start steering if there's somebody here maybe a car or bus then do it a bit early otherwise you should be go to halfway and then you make the turn now let's talk about when you should take the wheel back after you've made the turn so for example just say you were going from there to there you keep the car straight and you start steering from here and then you when you've done the steering the car will start going when the car goes in make sure you know when you should start taking the wheel back because if you wait until the car is dead straight by the time you take the wheel back the car is going to end up going to the pavement and then it's going to do that so what you need to do is wait so what you need to do is do the steering and as the car goes in when the car is nearly straight nearly straight start taking the wheel back slowly and as you take the wheel back car goes slowly and when the car is fully straight you take the wheel fully straight so don't wait until the car is fully straight until you take the wheel back you must um, start taking the wheel back a bit early so when the car is nearly straight start taking the wheel back and by the time the car is straight your wheel is going to be straight many students the, in the beginning the mistake they make is they wait until the car is fully straight and that's when they start to take the wheel back and this is wrong because by the time you take the wheel back you're going to end up going to the pavement so what you need to do is start taking the wheel back just before the car is nearly straight and then start taking the wheel back and by the time the car is straight your wheel is going to be straight and that's the point so on this road we will be turning right so you've looked at the mirrors you gave signal and stay on the left hand side and keep the car straight until we reach the point where we're going to make the turn and the point is when our right side mirror is in line with the center of the road that we want to go in so when the right side mirror is in line with the center of the road that we want to go in and as you can see in the picture now the mirror is in line with the center of the road that we want to make the turn or we want to go in once you reach that point you do the turning and then when the car is nearly straight the road that we're going in that's when you start taking the wheel back so nearly straight take the wheel back and by the time we take the wheel back the car should be straight and as you can see now it's straight and you just carry on driving forward on this road we will be turning left which means you looked at the mirrors you've signaled and you've correct your position and then you look at the road and wait for the road to wait for the turning point so now you know where the corner is wait for that corner to come on the left corner of your dashboard now you start steering then you wait until the car is nearly straight and that's when you start taking the wheel back and you wait until the car is straight and then when the car is straight you just drive on at the end of this road we will be turning left so you looked at the mirrors you've signaled and you positioned yourself correctly and then you will look at the road layout and as you can see this road turns towards left at the end which means you need to keep your speed low and you steer left to reach the giveaway line and then if it's safe we will carry on going if not we will stop behind the line in this case it is safe there's no one coming so we will carry on and when the car is nearly straight and that's when you start taking the wheel back and when it's straight you just carry on keep going forward 
at the end of this road coming up, we will be going right, which means we looked at the mirrors, we signaled, and after the van, we will position ourselves towards left, and then we will reach the giveaway line looking at the road, how the road is laid out, if it's safe. We will reach halfway, and then we will steer when we reach our side of the road, which is left-hand side, and then when the car is nearly straight, take the wheel back, and then when the car is straight, we just drive on going forward. Okay, I hope I have given you enough in this video for you to understand. Uh, the main thing is to uh, look at the junctions that you are dealing with and analyze before and always look the way the road is laid out. So if the corners are a bit curvy, you steer with it. The way the junction is going, that's the way you steer. So always look on the floor and look for the junction the way it is laid out. So if it's straight, keep the wheel straight. And if it bends a little, you steer a little bit with it, with the bend. And that's the main way. So always look on the floor and see how the junction is laid out and that's the best way to deal with um, the steering um, when you are dealing with junctions always look on the floor and see the way the junction is laid out that's the best way okay that's it for today and i hope you've enjoyed the video if you did please do give a thumbs up and if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe and please do make a comment what you think of the video and hope to see you again on the next video bye for now